So here we are with a quick update. Uh, wrecking the elm. Still working on elm number one. A bit slow going. This is the canopy of elm number two. You're next. This is uh, some of what's left to do. Further up there, as you can see, lots of damage. Storm damage, wind damage, lightning damage, squirrel damage. And taking a quick break, some water. That's my equipment. There's my spurs. There's my saw dangling, little baby boo. There's the lunch bag. This is what we've taken down this evening. Couple of limbs. A bit tough, heavy stuff. Had to use some felling cuts as you can see. And that in the background is the Owyhee Mountains. And that fine filly all the way down there is Elastina Luisa Valencia. Minx! She does a wonderful British accent. So, as you can see, that's where I'm tied in with the rope. But the problems we have here is that's Corey's house right there. And as you can see, this stuff goes all the way over Corey's house. Oh, what's that? That is a power cable, our enemy. So we've got to watch out for all that. What we're doing right now though, as you can see, is I have a good clear drop zone on this side. So I'm dropping stuff down. And I'm still waiting for my rope rigging kit to be delivered from Cheryl Tree Services all the way in Georgia. They assure me that it's coming. That's the poplar forest out the back. I'm kind of tied in so I can't quite turn 360, but that's the house all the way down there. So far, so good. Signing off. Whoa.